Hello, hello, everybody. Good evening. How are you? How was your day, guys? Hello, teacher. Good evening. What are you laughing? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Hello, Marlenis. How are you? How was your day? I Good am night. great. Okay, thank you so much. That's glad to hear that. Hey, Carla Susana say good evening, everybody, okay? Bienvenidos, chicos, una vez más a otra sesión de inglés para el trabajo. English for work, okay? So, we are going to wait some minutes in order to the other partners can connect it, okay? Alexa say good evening, everybody. Good evening, Alexa. And welcome. So we have one minute past eight, guys, and we are going to wait five minutes, okay? Because we have to pass the list. For a while, guys, we can talk about what you did yesterday, how was your day, something like it, right? Try to speak a little bit. What happened today? Teacher, I work, 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 like a Rihanna, right? And I made my dinner, I took a shower, right? I'm a little bit sick, teacher. Oh, okay, Alexa, I understand that. Thank you for noticing me. Okay, have you already take to have to can take or, or take pills, right? You already take pills, some pills, right? Right? Ya tomó unas pastillas, eh, Alexa. Yes, I, I have medicine. Okay, perfect. Great. So if you want, you can connect your camera. Just uh, hear the class. Because I understand that you feel not so, not so good, right? You went to the doctor this morning. Okay, perfect. Excellent. That's good, guys. If you feel sick, please go to the doctor. It's important that you also take some pills in order to feel better. Because every day we have to work and we cannot say, I'm going to stay at home because I am I wanted to rest. Because sometimes it, eh, the work is not, not let us, right, to do that. So we have to take some pills, right? I go to the doctor and have a certification that you were in the doctor. You presented to the work. Okay, work, please. Okay, guys, welcome. Welcome, Jose Roberto, Pedro, Mauricio, Edwin Abarca, Wilfredo Gomez, Yuri, Mario, Lisette Medrano. Hello. Hello. Teacher, help me. Uh -huh. en, en la unidad 2, en la tarea 6. Eh, en una en síntesis uh -huh. tengo problemas en una oración física ok Va. si gustan podemos tomar ese tiempo para hacer las tareas recuerden chicos que esta semana es el midterm ok usted tiene que hacer las cinco tareas y tiene que hacer el midterm Qué bueno que me recordó Daniel Porque es importante tenerlo en cuenta. Acuérdense que siempre hay que ir tarea, clase hecha, tarea, clase hecha, tarea. Y si puede avanzar dos tareas, está bien. Si usted ya va a saber del tema y si no puede preguntarme a mí también. ¿okay? Siempre hay que hacer la tarea y para no estarlos este, atrasando. Recuérdense que semana a semana en Safor pide actualización de datos. right? En este caso sería las tareas. It is important you to make the homeworks, okay? So, if you want, we can have a space to make that, okay? After saying the class, we're going to get like a half or an hour, a half of an hour, of an hour to make that, una media hora antes, okay? Podemos empezar con las tareas, ¿les parece? Okay. Are you agree? Or would you like to do it right now? I consider it could be at the end because first of all, we have to see the topic, we have to make the exercise in order to understand the, what the homework is about. Yeah. 
Okay, let me check. I'm going to open the platform. Just give me some minutes, guys. I will be at the end. Okay, I will be. Will be. Will will be good at the end, right? Yes, you're right. Let's give me some minutes, guys. Guys, guys. Teacher is correct. Así como se lo mandé. Okay, let me check. Just give me some minutes. In the chat. Ah, in the meeting chat. Okay, mm -hmm. perfect. Just give me some minutes. Okay. She doesn't speak Portuguese. It's Portuguese, if I'm not mistake, it's without A. Gracias, no, primero. Sí, sí. Okay, Portuguese or Portuguese, right? Portuguese. Not portuguesa, es portugués. Se, se escribe en vez de la e, de la a es una e. Portugués, right? That's why it is not good. I don't know if it is a mistake from the the translator or something like this, right? She doesn't speak Portuguese. I don't have much signal since I am my way from San Salvador to La Unión. Okay, Yuri, no worries. Just let me know when you arrive at your home, okay? No worry for that. Thank you. Okay, so I will be better. I it will be better in the last ten minutes after. Okay, teacher. Thank you. Awesome. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nah. Right. <laughs> okay, it will be better in the last ten minutes after class, right? After class, no, it's going to be before class. Before the well, see, see, before, before finish the class, the two hours of the class, right? We are going to take that. I consider we can take uh fifteen minutes or twenty minutes in order to make that right. Okay, so just give me some minutes, guys. We were talking about daily routines, right? Yesterday. So what was your daily routines, guys? Guys, what was your daily routines? Roberto, activa el, desactiva el micrófono, papi. Ok, Roberto. 
Okay, thank you so much, right? Okay, so I'm going to share the screen, guys. And, ah, by the way, I'm going to pass a list. Sorry. Before I start with the class, we're going to pass a list. Because I tend to forget it, guys. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm looking for that. Where is Roxana? Okay, it's here. Okay, so let's continue, guys. Alexia Guadalupe Lopez, Viuda de Vasquez. I'm here. Thank you. Berta Lisette Merano Medrano. Daniel Jonas Hernández García. Present teacher. Excellent. Edwin Asuncion Abarta Celayan Díaz. Present teacher. Thank you. Edwin Walter Flores Munguía. Jose Roberto Perla Guevara. Karen Beatriz Ramírez López. Present teacher. Excellent, Karen. Carla Susena Flores de Ponce. Present teacher. Thank you. Laura Guadalupe Bonilla Cruz. Luis Enrique Valé, Bel, Valera, yes, Valera Rodríguez. Mauricio Alexander González Celaya. Mauri, Mario, ay Dios mío, Mario. Mario, Mario. sorry, Mario. <laughs> Mauricio, Mauricio. Don't worry. Don't worry. Uh, I, can, I can see you well. <laughs> I'm sorry. Ya no me sirven los lentes. Ya. <laughs> es Varela, Varela. Permítame, es que aquí le han puesto. Let me see. Yes, you're right. But here is the other. Varela, ajá. Aquí le han puesto. Había desactivado el micrófono, por eso no le contesté. Aquí le han puesto Valera. Can I show you? Can I show you? Sí, Varela. Varela o Valera. No es Varela. Va, aquí le han puesto Valera. Right. That's why, okay, I know. I'm... No sé. It's not my fault, right? <laughs> okay, just give me some minutes and I'm going to try Varela. to change it. Varela. Varela, okay, al revés. Lo Varela. Okay, perfect. So let's continue. Mario Alexander Gonzalez Celaya. <laughs> I'm here, teacher. <laughs> Thank you. Don't worry. No worries. She's all right. I'm sorry. What a shame. Eh, Marlene is not me, Martinez Reyes. Present, teacher. Thank you. Pablo Josué Mansor Cruz. Pedro Ángel Benítez Andrade. Pedro Mauricio Velázquez Sorto. Presente, teacher. Excellent. Wilfredo Gómez Robles. Jenis Noemí Contreras Mendoza. Y Yuri Vanessa Rivas de Pima. Present, teacher. Okay, thank you, guys. So this is the first time that I passed the list, okay? And also I had the grades from your first week, right? Aquí están sus notas de la primera semana, chicos. Invito a los chicos que están pues con el 40, el 60%, chicos, el 20% a que terminemos pues la, las tareas. Pero recuerde que mientras no ha terminado el curso, usted puede acceder a todas esas tareas y aumentar la nota, corregir los mistakes que usted tiene ahí y poder avanzar, ¿verdad? Y obtener el 100%, que sería lo más ideal, ¿verdad? Tener un 100% en cada una de las semanas para que su promedio final sea el 100%. Quiere decir que usted va a pasar con 10 el, el curso, ¿verdad? Entonces, I invite you guys that you change your grade, try to fix that, and try to make the homework, please. If you want, we, we can take and we can help you also. Remember that in the group, you can share with your partners. The point is that we all, we, all of us, we can get the grades and we can pass the course, okay? So if you want to share this uh, screenshot, if you want to share some uh, answers about that, 
you can do it, okay? And you can share with them. And the other ones that doesn't have uh, the questions, the, sorry, the answer, the correct answer, and you have uh, questions about the mistakes, you can ask also there, right? And we can help you, okay? Everybody's going to help you, each other, okay? So let's continue. Now we're going to uh, share, right? Not here. What is the manual? But it's very clear. It's the manual. Control de asistencia. No, it's not there. Vaya, miren, les voy a compartir lo de las, las notas. These are your grades for the first week. Estas son las notas de la primera semana, ¿ok? Entonces, ahí, un llamado a los chicos y chicas. Pueden aumentar la nota, Usted puede avanzar, puede avanzar también la siguiente semana. Si usted, pues, tiene conocimiento, usted puede avanzar en lo que usted quiera. Recordémonos que el midterm está por acá. Algunos ya tienen el 100% del midterm y otros tienen el 60% avanzado del midterm, que sería el examen de esta semana, right? Pues también les aconsejo, ¿verdad? Y les invito a que podamos, pues, avanzar despacio y que nos tengamos a las carreras al último. Tratemos de hacer las tareas, tratemos de avanzar un poco en cada una de las secciones del Mitre. Siempre recordarles que le deben enviar cada vez que termine una parte del Mitre, porque si no le da enviar, no le va a, a guardar los datos. ¿Ok? Entonces, por cada parte que usted finalice del, del examen medio, Usted tiene que darle enviar, al igual que las tareas, ¿ok? ¿Es clear? Perfecto, ¿ok? Go ahead. Sure. Tell me. Ok, eh, en, las, en las tareas, estoy uh -huh. viendo que, bueno, en todas aparece Carla que ha completado todas las tareas, ¿verdad? Sí. Uh -huh. Pero fíjese que yo igual, yo de hecho ya estoy en la unidad 2 y todos los chequecitos me parecen así en verde, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Entonces no entiendo por qué no, no aparece, digamos, la... La unidad. Usted ya finalizó no. la unidad 2. Ya terminé la unidad 1. Uh -huh. Y... Ya empecé la unidad 2. Okay. Entonces, cuando yo selecciono la, la tarea 2, digamos, de la unidad 1, uh -huh. ya me aparece a mí así en un chequecito verde, digamos, ¿verdad? Que está completada. Ajá, pero es que vaya. Y le, y le doy a enviar. Ajá. Aquí le doy a enviar. Entonces. Y me dice, correcto, 20 de 20 puntos, ¿verdad? Sí, así es. Eh, sí, pero no sé si realmente se sube o no se sube. Vaya, vamos a explicar algo. Permítame. Eh, let me see where were, was the grades. Ya ahorita, cuando la existencia, acá estamos, ¿ok? Vaya, voy a compartir otra vez. One more time. Ok, chicos, esto que dice acá es Homework Week 1. Okay. Homework Week 1. Tareas, semana 1. Tareas, semana 2. Tareas, semana 3. Tareas, semana 4. Quiere decir que aquí está el promedio final de las cinco tareas que usted ha hecho. Quiere decir que si usted hizo las cinco tareas de la semana 1, usted tiene el 100%. Cada una de las tareas vale el 20%. Entonces quiere decir que el compañerito, el compañerito, la compañerita acá solamente ha hecho tres, porque tiene el 60%. Y los demás chicos que tienen el 100% es que han finalizado las cinco tareas de la unidad. Entonces, vaya, si usted ya me termina la unidad 2, aquí le va a ir apareciendo el 100%, pero tal vez los chicos del staff no lo han actualizado porque no se ha finalizado la semana 2. Entonces, el día viernes que usted lo finalice, 
ellos van a ellos van a actualizar las notas. Tal vez a Carla se le ha actualizado todo porque ella ya lo terminó en la primera semana y ellos se dieron cuenta que ella ya había finalizado todos los ejercicios y todas las, las tareas. Por eso es que se lo han actualizado en la primera semana. Entonces, como usted está trabajando ahorita en eso, ¿verdad? Entonces, al final de la segunda semana le van a actualizar. Si usted termina la semana 2, la semana 3, en esta semana, ya la otra semana le van a aparecer las dos. ¿Ok? ¿Guys? Ok, teacher. Thank you. Ok, perfect. Excellent. Another question, guys? Another question? Bueno, también chicos, eh, cuando usted quiera ver el porcentaje de avance que usted tiene en el curso, puede entrar a la plataforma y ya les voy a explicar cómo pueden hacer. Vaya, ahorita les comparto otra vez. Bueno, cuando usted quiere saber cómo va en cuanto a porcentajes, usted se va acá, mire, abre esto, como que está abriendo el manual, ¿verdad? Ahora vamos donde dice progreso, ¿ok? Nos vamos donde dice progreso, le damos clic y aquí usted ve cuál es el porcentaje que usted tiene. ¿Ok? Semana 1, completado. Promedio, ¿verdad? El 25%. Porque son cuatro semanitas, right? Cada semanita tiene el 25%, digamos, de cada, este, del promedio final de cada semana. ¿Ok? Al hacer un 100%. ¿Ok? O sea, o sea que la plataforma, independientemente del avance que tenga, se actualiza hasta el día viernes. O sea, así de... No, en la plataforma usted puede ver su porcentaje, ¿verdad? Así, no, miren. es con respecto a la pregunta anterior, porque igual yo ya solo me falta una actividad de la, de la, de la segunda unidad, pero no aparece el avance, o sea, me imagino Ajá. que se aparece hasta el día viernes. Es que la, lo que le estaba mostrando es la lista de asistencia y el control que lleva en Safor. Uh -huh. Ellos ven los datos en la plataforma, la plataforma le actualiza, le actualiza automáticamente. Usted termina una tarea al momento y ya se actualiza pero ellos pasan los datos de la plataforma al control de asistencia y a los datos de, de notas para Insafor los días viernes. Mm. Entonces, el mejor lugar para ver su avance sería este. Sí. Así es. Ok, another question. Guys, no, okay. So let's pass to the manual, guys. Let's do it, right? Okay. So the last class we were talking about occupation, right? We were touching the the topic of occupations like doctor, the eh, eh, what? Dentist, right? Builder, bed. What else? Or the daily routines. We were talking about daily routines. Yes, we were talking about daily routines and we were talking about job position, right? Like a bookkeeper, financial analyst, human resources specialist, digital marketing manager, insurance agent, software engineer, right? What was insurance agent? What does it mean, guys? ¿Qué significa insurance agent? Agente de seguro. Agente de seguro, muy bien. En software engineer. Ingeniero de sistema. Exactly. Digital marketing manager. Jefe de marketing digital. Exactly. Thank you so much, Carla. Human resources specialist.
Especialista de recursos humanos. Okay, what was the meaning of bookkeeper? Cajera o algo así. Contador. Contador, okay. Bookkeeper is like a contact. You can use both, right? Financial analyst. So, and also we were asking for the occupations of some of our, our partners, right? And you say, um, digitizer, right? Engineer, what was the other one? Cashier. Cashier. Executive. Executive. And what was their, ta their tasks, right? Que es lo que ellos hacen en el trabajo? You were... Uh, giving some information about them, right? So what we're going to do now, guys, let's talk about affirmative statement and negative statement in simple present. The last classes we were talking about verb to be. Do you remember that? Las clases pasadas estuvimos hablando acerca del verbo to be en presente, right? How to make affirmative and negative statement, but with verb to be. In this case, we're going to talk about simple present, but with verbs in present, regular and irregular verbs. ¿Cuáles son los verbos regulares e irregulares, verdad? Ya lo vamos a ver. Son, los verbos son los que describen una acción, la acción que nosotros hacemos en presente simple. ¿Ok? Por ejemplo, tenemos, I keep track on the financial account. You know the policies and regulations. We advertise the company. They help companies against financial loss. loss. Okay. ¿Qué significa keep? Keep track significa dar seguimiento a algo. Okay. I keep track to the financial financial account. Yo le doy seguimiento a las cuentas financieras, right? You know the policies and regulations. Tú sabes las, eh, como las Política, políticas y las regulaciones, Política. right? Eh, we advertise the company. Nosotros, eh, nosotros, eh, como es de medio de la palabra en español. Eh, nosotros anunciamos o publicitamos. La, publicitamos la compañía. Exactly. Publicitamos the company o de com o la empresa. Uh -huh. And they help companies again financial loss. Ellos ayudan a las compañías a, a evadir o contra las pérdidas financieras, uh -huh. right? Okay, this is the affirmative statement, ¿verdad? Some positive. But what about the negative statement? To construct the negative statements, we are going to use the auxiliary verb don't, do, or does, right? Plus the word not. Más la palabra not, que en este caso sería la abreviación de do not. In this case, it's don't. Uh -huh. You can use don't do get, not, or, do you not. Can, uh -huh, or you can use don't. No. For example, I don't keep track of the financial account. We don't know the policies and regulations. We don't advertise the company. They don't help companies against financial loss. O sea, que se le agrega antes del verbo. Exactly. You are going to add the negative form before the verb in this case. Okay? En cambio, con el ver verbo to be se agrega después. Por ejemplo, he is an executive. He is an a executive. Or he is not an executive. Okay? But in this case, we are talking about simple present using simple verbs. We are going to add don't with the negative form. Before the verb, the main verb that describes the action that is talking about, or the subject is doing right now, right? Is clear? More or less. Okay. 
And let me check another thing, right? So let's see simple press. Affirmative and negative statement. Let's do it. Okay, let's see. Okay, okay, simple present negative statement. Bueno, tenemos las affirmative, right? This is the structure that you are going to follow. For example, we have subject plus infinitive verb, that is el verbo infinitivo en presente simple, right? Más el complemento, plus the complement. For example, I play soccer and Remember that when we talk about third person, we are going to add S to the verb. She plays soccer. You make the homework. You take the bus. They study so, right now. Matt, right? So watch. He reads, uh-huh. He reads the book. He, she cooks the chicken, right? Or we cook the chicken. If you want to use as first and second person, you are going to use the verb as it is in base form. You're not going to change anything. But if you're going to use third person, you are going to change the verb by adding the S at the end. Pero eso lo vamos a ver más adelante, ¿ok? Cuando hablemos de terceras personas. Ahorita solo enfocémonos en el verbo base, ¿ok? No vamos a aplicar eh, reglas gramaticales en cuanto a terceras personas por ahorita. Okay, he reads the book. She cooks the chicken. It plays with the ball. He goes to the school. She was she washes her car. It kisses its owner. But I kiss my ball, my boy, right? He takes the bus. We take the bus. She buy a car. This could be the affirmative form of simple present. But when we want to express negative sentences on negative form, we are going to use this structure. Subject plus do or does, it depends on what are the persons that you're going to use, right? Está compartiendo. Ah, eso mismo. Está compartiendo el manual. Ah, okay. Perfect. Thank you. Dígame, dígame. Let me know. Estamos perdidos ahí. Ah, dale. But let me know, guys. Let me know. Es que estaba compartiendo siempre, pero como cambio de ventana, a veces ya no, no lo comparte, right? Okay. So, this is a simple present, as I told you before, right? This is the, this is the structure that you're going to follow when you are going to get positive statement o oraciones en afirmativo, okay? Subject plus infinity verb plus the complement, ¿ok? Esa va a ser la estructura en forma positiva. Y acá tenemos algunos ejemplos, right? You can take some of them. Not all of them, because it's going to take a lot of time. If you want, you can take a screenshot and you are going to share us in the WhatsApp group in order to have it. Everybody have it, right? Or maybe you can share us in the meeting chat also. If you want, right? Just let me know when you finish to take notes in order to pass to another stage.
¿En qué me escucha? Sí, por el otro lado. No, aquí no. ¿Quién lo dio antes? ¿Se nació, va? ¿Y me voy a hacer para mañana? Let me know when you finish, guys.
If you want, you can take some of them, not all of them, okay? Si quieren, pueden tapar algunos, no todos, right? Because of the time. And remember that we have to follow, right? Okay, did you finish? Okay, perfect. So let's continue, guys. So as I told you before, that was the affirmative form. But in this case, we're going to talk about also the negative forms of the statements. In this case, we are going to use the following structure. We are going to use subject plus do or does plus the word not plus the verb in infinitive form plus the complement, okay? Here could be do or does or doesn't, right? In this case, you are going to use, I don't like pizza, for example. You don't like pizza. We don't like pizza. They don't like pizza. This is for the first and the second person, right? Remember that when first and second person, we are going to use do. In negative form, don't, okay? But in third person, like he, she, and it, we are going to use doesn't, okay? Because they are third person. So in this case, we have he doesn't like pizza. In positive, could be he likes pizza. He does not or he doesn't like pizza. She doesn't pizza. In positive, could be she likes pizza. He doesn't like cookies. It likes cookies. She cooks very well. She doesn't cook very well. I don't like running. I like running. So this is the affirmative and negative form together in order that you can understand what I mean, right? So you're going to take notes. Just let me know when you finish, please. Hola.
finish. Guys, finish. Okay, okay. Let's continue, guys, because of the time, okay? So you can write it down, not all of the examples, but also you can write down some of them. Okay, it's not necessary that you write every everything, right? Because of the time. Here we have something more specific, more summarized, okay? For example, we have affirmative, negative, and interrogative. Remember that always we have these three forms, affirmative, negative, and interrogative. But in this case, we're going to just see the two first forms, affirmative and negative. After that, we are going to pass to the question form or a interrogative form. So let's do it. Uh, would you like to, to make a practice about that sentence? Yes. Okay, so we're going to make the practice. I'm going to send it to the WhatsApp group. Okay, perfect. So what we are going to do now? Okay, we're going to continue with the man like this. It's better, right? because we're going to get advantage. And remember that we have to do the homework. Okay, bye. Eso es lo que estábamos hablando ahí anteriormente. So there are some examples. What we're going to do now, guys, we're going to scramble the sentences with the words provide using the simple present tense, okay? So here you have some words in this order, but you have to order the sentences in the correct form. For example, what is the correct form here? ¿Cuál es la forma correcta de la oración? Se tiene que reordenar la oración en la forma correcta, utilizando las palabras que le dan entre las flechas. Okay? Para afirmativo y negativo. Yes, but in this case, you are going to make it just positive. Si okay. de... Si le dan el not aquí entre las palabras, sí va a ser negativo, pero si no, es positivo. Solamente lo que le pide ahí. Ajá, porque aquí está negativo. Fíjense que aquí tiene el don't. Ok. Ok, go ahead.
Let me know when you finish, guys. Okay. Erwin Abarca is already done. Okay, Carla Flores is already done, Edwin Navarca is already done, also, and Marlenis Martinez is already done. Okay, so let's check it, guys. So, let's do it. What is the first one? Uh-huh. Who say the first one? Este Huh? They keep track. They keep track. Uh-huh. Of financial. Of financial. 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 So it's a little Financial. Accounts. Companies. Of companies, right? Companies. Because why two, right? ¿Por qué dos, chicos? Porque aquí dice dos. O sea, quiere decir que hay dos of, right? So they keep track of financial account of companies. Okay, very good. Excellent. So let's do it the next one. Let's do the next one. What is the second one? We don't... 
Which one? We don't. We don't. Albert. 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 Things. The company. Advertise. The company. The company. No, on internet. On internet, right? Internet. Yes. On internet. Internet, right? Okay, perfect. So, let's continue with, it, with the next one. Number number three. Mm -hmm. I take notes in the meetings every day. I take notes. Take notes every day. Oh. Every day. Take notes day. in the meetings. In the meeting. Uh -huh. I take in notes day. in the meeting every day. Every day. Take notes. Take notes. Everything in the meeting every day, okay. Every day, so this is the order. So let's let's do the fourth one, okay. What is the fourth one? Carlos and Mauricio answered the phone at the reception. Mauricio answered the reception, okay. Answer. At the reception. The phone in the reception. Or at the reception. At, at the reception. At, at the reception. Okay, perfect. Excellent, guys. Go ahead. Thank you. That's the way. This is the correct order, right? So let's change this. Okay, so let's do the next one. I forgot it. I forgot it. So what we're going to do now, guys, we're going to complete the practice and practice the conversation with a new classmate using your own names and information to guide. Continue the conversation in your own way. For example, we have activi activities that I can do, right? What are the activities that I can do at my workplace? What are some activities that you usually do in your workplace? Hmm? I Answer. Answer the phone. Attend. Attention. Attention. Uh -huh. Attend clients or customers. Can ask. Yes. Make reports. Make reports. Uh -huh. Answer the phone. Can ask. What else? The reception. Okay, attend the reception, right? Or maybe uh, you can organize meeting, right? Organizar reuniones. Maybe it could be another uh, task in your workplace, okay? Or receive the client or give a gift to a client. Maybe, right? So you are going to write five activities that you usually do in your workplace, okay? Five activities. If you want, you can look in the internet in order to have more vocabulary words because I know that you are studying this and it's important that you use a resource that is in this case is going to be the internet, okay? Look at the internet and look for activities that you can do at your workplace. And you can find five, you can find five, right? And write it down there and then we're going to share it with the general meeting, okay? It's clear what you're going to do? Mm. So, so, teacher, <laughs> tell me, we do more than five activities. <laughs> you do oh, okay, you do more activities than five, right? But in this case, yes, we are going to take five. <laughs> okay, perfect. Vaya, van a escribir, van a buscar en internet si ustedes gustan tener ayuda, verdad? O pueden traducir. O utilizar el, el recurso del internet ¿verdad? para buscar actividades que usted generalmente hace en su trabajo. 
y me las van a escribir acá. Solo cinco actividades, ¿ok? ¿Es clear? Ok. Great, go ahead, guys.
Let me know when you finish, guys. Finish?
Finish. Do you need more time? Okay, go ahead. Finish. Do you need more time?
finish. Okay, perfect. So, some volunteers that can help me. <clears throat> Wilfredo. Okay, go ahead. <clears throat> Volunteers or victims? Volunteers or victims? Uh huh. We. Oui. Okay, perfect. Go ahead. Tell us. Will you are victim? Victim. Okay. Hi, victims. Yes. You choose me or the teacher. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Edwin. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? I'm fine. And you? What are you doing now? Hi. Ok, solamente pueden decir las actividades como oración, right? Like, I make reports, I make phone calls, and those kind of things, right? Ok, Edwin, can you tell me some activities you do in your workday? Yes, I am. Uh, I answer phone every day. I visit clients every day. I, I do finance a report. Um, I call, I call it money from client at home and I send message to client. It's not sound so exciting your day, but I think it's boring. But my day or my activities day, it's like something like that because I have a receipt and sell documents too, and check email, send and receive customer service, meetings, take, uh, make phone calls, deliver credit cards, and can I keep going? <laughs> <laughs> so that was my day. Okay, today. perfect. And I hope tomorrow will be better, right? Better. <laughs> <laughs> okay, perfect. So somebody else? Victims? Yes, or... Mario. Okay, Mario. Mario. Mario okay, Mario. Mario. Okay, Mario. Okay, Mario. You're welcome, Mario. It's not here, Mario. <laughs> Salió de la reunión, Mario. Dice. Salió de la reunión. Ok. okay. Entonces, Carla Susana Flores, ok. No, hombre, ahí está. I watching you, I watching you. Ok, Mario, Mario. I'm here, I'm here. Ok, perfecto. Okay, it's the same, it's the same, oh, okay, wait a minute, wait a minute, please. Okay, no worries, take your time. This is translation, it's important. No, Mario, I'm sorry, I cannot give into copy. I'm not copying. Okay, teacher. It's the same as the uh -huh. others. It's the same job. 
It's the same job. Yeah. So you have the yeah. same activities. <laughs> maybe, maybe uh, uh, offer credits, offer credit cards, customer service, account opening. That's all. Search new clients like the teacher, right? No words. Mm -hmm. Okay, do it. You can tell the activities. No worry if it is uh, something the same, right? Like the same that your partners have. The point is that you have to practice and say something, right? <laughs> okay, we we like watching you. <laughs> you are a big team. <laughs> you are big teams. Do you want big teams? <laughs> okay, teams. go Roll ahead. Out. Okay, try it, please, try it. At least one. Okay, I choose the big team, let's see. Um, Jose, Jose Roberto Perla. Hi, teacher. Hi. Mm -hmm. that's that's our songs active and i i do daily and this is um uh, important uh -huh. number one money money monitor monitoring monitoring the degree of slaves payment plans okay you should usually and uh, remind consumers of private take. It's como that or fetch mm -hmm. or seguimiento. How have we free communication with clients? Este sería la tercera. Okay. Um, number, four, number four. And provide financial solution yeah. of clients for investment in their business. Okay. Number five, control my call. Okay, control? My call. Goals. Your calls. Goals. Okay. Uh -huh, goals. Uh, your goals, okay, perfect. I'm finished. So, excellent, thank you so much. So, somebody else? You're welcome. Um, when asked, <laughs> uh huh. Somebody else choose another partner, please. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody searching victims. Don't permission to bully into you. Everybody wants the victims. <laughs> oh, no. Somebody else volunteers. Voluntarios, chicos. Aria, depending on you, if you are going yeah. to learn English, okay, try to. Practice, right to participate because it is important. The same big things as always. Activities I do. Yes, uh huh. The activities in you every do. Every day or in the work? No, 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 you, can, no. you can say at work. Ah, oh, sorry, no. And every day. Uh huh. No, teacher. Yo las hice de. Las actividades del día, no, no del trabajo. Auxilio. Oh, ah, ok. <laughs> ok, entonces oh, hágala, dígame las del me. día, entonces. Tell me about the day. Activity. Carla Azucena is, no. it's, ok, it's raising the hand. Ok, Carla Azucena, go ahead. Uh, so, my activities at work are send and reply to emails. Answer the phone, account for company operation, mm -hmm. report, uh, account money. 
Okay, perfect, excellent. Somebody else? Jonas. Karen, your turn. Karen, your turn. Okay, Karen. Would you like to pass? Chiquita. Chiquita. Chiquita, le decís. Ay, no, qué Chiquita. Estás ahí, chiquitita. Le dile el oro con cariñito. Ajá. Activities I do. Um, service clients. Answer from calls. Enter information in the system. Send reports and take documents to another area. Area, ¿cómo? Okay. Eh, ¿Cómo se? Uh -huh. Area, ajá. Uh -huh. Sí, área, sí. Uh -huh. take, uh -huh. take documents to another area. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. What else? <risa> Vamos chiquita, tú puedes. No te preocupes, se mm -hmm. pronuncia mal. Um, <risa> sí, no se preocupen, acuérdense que estamos aprendiendo. No, no es que va a hacerlo perfectamente de la primera vez, ok, no worries. Go ahead, guys, try. Dale, animala, rorro, animala. Vamos, chiquita, bella. Oh, Tú puedes. Yeah. <risa> Vamos, bebé. Cinco, ya estuvo, ya la tiene. Más, ner más nerviosa la pusiste, rorro. No. Beatriz, te falta una. No, dije cinco. Fine, okay. Let's choose another another partner, please. Okay, no worries. Right. Escogemos Hola. a otro Karen, please. Hola. Um, otro Karen. <laughs> este. Luis Varela. Coming. Welcome. <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> um, okay. Um bueno, uh, number one, uh I call play in the morning. Uh, number two, I'm following up on spirit claims. Mm -hmm. Number three. Then I make credit for the committee. Uh, number four. Then I verif verify consumer payments. Um, number five. Then I report the date uh, results. Fine. Right. Okay. Excellent. So choose another one. Um no second fault. Uh, uh, otra víctima. Otra, otra víctima. Otra víctima. Jenny, Mario, uh -huh. yes. yeah, we... pasando lista, estoy present. <laughs> Is that... <laughs> Is that... Hi. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Try, guys. She Don't. was asleep. Don't be afraid. Don't be afraid, guys. I Sorry. said, okay, good Sorry, morning. Said. I, I serve clients. Mm -hmm. I, I'll win my colleagues. My colleagues? Uh -huh. I archive documents. I get up to Avalanche. Ajá. Ya dije cinco. Ya dije cinco. Five, five. Five more, five more. You five more. Yes. Five La more, victoria. you can do it. Congratulations. Good job. Uh... Yuri Rivas, ya pasó. Yuri. Oh. I am driving, teacher. Ah, you are driving, right? Okay, perfect. So, somebody else wants to participate? Somebody else wants to participate? Guys? Choose, Will, choose. <laughs> Don't be afraid, Will. <laughs> Don't be afraid. Sabe que lo de la reunión, profe. Don't be afraid, guys. Yo teacher. Uh -huh. Excellent, Jonas. <laughs> Good job, big team. <laughs> okay. Okay, so, uh, activities I do in the work. Provence the customer for this board, this board cement, this board cement. Okay. Uh, visit the customer okay. for payment. Calling the customer for payment agreement, mm -hmm. uh, prepare committee credits. Finish it. <laughs> <laughs> Finish him. <laughs> okay, Alexa Guadalupe. I okay. I drink my coffee. I drive it. She's driving. Two, one, two, three. <laughs> no, drink coffee. Okay, I usually make reports, send emails, answer the phone, attend clients, and archive documents. Okay, perfect, excellent. <clears throat> Sorry, <laughs> I'm bad on my, on my throat, right? Okay, somebody else wants to give a uh, hair on his activities to the class? Somebody mm -hmm. else? Edwin? Abarca? <laughs> you were yeah. waiting. I had yeah. zero. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Marlene? Play your Sorry. number, man. <laughs> <laughs> Marlene? Hi, teacher. <laughs> okay, could you give us your uh, activities, please? Activity I do. Yes. Um, Customer service, attend meeting, report the card, the credit card, mm -hmm. achieve fill credit card, <coughs> my my key telephone verification, pins. Uh -huh. Okay, excellent. Choose another partner, Marlene. Pedro, Mauricio. Hola, Pedro, falta. Ah, sí, Pedro. Mm -hmm. Pedro, Mauricio, Velázquez, ah. Soto. Hello, Hi. teacher. Ah, ok. Perfect. Ok. My job is to supervise customer service staff 
uh, review credit file as well customer call follow follow up credit application mm -hmm. that's all Uh. Ready. Listo. <laughs> 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 Mm -hmm, guys. <clears throat> Guy. Mario, te hablan. <laughs> Nobody? Okay, let's continue, guys. Just give me some minutes and I'm going to. Share this premier game, okay? Okay. <laughs> it does a real malo que son, right? <laughs> Where's the man? <laughs> ya, ya no hay el, en la plataforma, miren, por estar hablando. <laughs> Ay, qué malo son. <laughs> Rorro. Hacele la carita sexy, Rorro. No se alogió, le pican a Rorro. Se puede, se puede asustar. La de Miss Portugal. ¿Portugués? La de Miss Portugal. Ajá. Muy extravagante. Se asustaría. Yo, si le hace una mirada así bien... Bien exótica. Sí, Rorro, sí. No, está bien. Tenemos una muy buena impresión con la teacher ahorita. Ok. So, let's continue, guys. Right. So, what we're going to do now. I need two volunteers who will read this short conversation, guys. Can I? Mario and me. It's only girls, look. <laughs> you are one. <laughs> you too. Volunteers, <laughs> mm -hmm. I choose. What I choose. Janet. Good morning, Cindy. How are you? Good, good morning, Carlita. How are you? Fine. <laughs> I have many things to do this week, but Cari is very busy. Really? The new secretary, his schedule is very tight. On Monday, she makes many phone calls. Later, she writes reports about the production. Mm -hmm. And by doing she too the other day. <laughs> On Wednesday, she sends some emails to the Brook Bookkeeper and on Friday she arrives meeting. Mm -hmm. He is supposed and I'm quick. <laughs> right. Don't you understand? Uh-huh. Another one who wants to participate. 
Okay, Mario. guys. Try to practice, okay? No, don't be Mario. this like a joke because it is Mario. important that you learn how to pronounce the words. Sorry, teacher. Mm -hmm. Let's try. Okay, Where perfect. You? The teachers become serious. Yes. I'm Janet. Mario, I am Janet. You are Cindy. Sometimes, sometimes you have to uh, be serious. Sometimes you have to get fun. You have to make a balance, okay? Okay. Cindy. <clears throat> Good morning, Cindy. How are you? Fine. I have many things to do this weekend. But Katie is very busy. Really? Who is Katie? The new secretary. Her children is very tight. On Monday, she makes many phone calls. Later, she writes reports about the productions. And what does she do the other days? On Wednesdays, she sends some emails to the bookkeeper. And on Friday, she arranges meetings. She is so busy. And on weekends? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Good morning, Roro. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. And you? Wait, pues. Fine, fine. I have many things to do this with, by, but Katie or Katy is very boss. Really? Who is as Katy? The new secretary, Charles, is very thing. On Monday, they make many phone calls. Katy. Days rise report about the production. And what does she do? She do the other days. Mm -hmm. Oh, on Wednesday, Wednesday, she sends some email to the bookkeeper, and on Friday, the arrest meeting. She is so busy on, on weekends. Fine. Mm -hmm. <laughs> fine, it's conversation. <laughs> so let's see. Uh, I'm going to read it, okay? No, no worries, okay? Just repeat after me, please. Um, what was it? The first one? Okay. Busy. Repeat. Busy. 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 Arrange. 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 Send. Arrange. Send. 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 Write. Right. 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 Makes. Make. Makes, makes, makes. Teacher, teacher, make. like you see, like you see, the the makes. A schedule, a schedule. No. Okay. Schedule. A schedule. A schedule. Schedule. A schedule. 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 Y right. lo que está en uh, donde dice Cindy antes de la última está bookkeeper, así es. Yes, bookkeeper. Yes, you're right. Bookkeeper. Bookkeeper. Fuentes. Fuentes. Es Merlina. Bookkeeper. Es una serie. 
<laughs> Good morning, Cindy. Okay, I'm going to read it by for you guys. Okay, let's listen. Okay. Good morning, Good morning, Cindy. How are you? Fine. I have many things to do this week, but Katie is very busy. Really? Who's Katie? The new secretary. Her schedule is very tight. On Monday, she makes many phone calls. Later, she writes reports about the production. And what does she do the other days? On Wednesday, she sends some emails to the bookkeeper. And on Friday, she arranged meetings. She is so busy. And on weekends? So this is the continuity of another uh, conversation. For example, here you can continue that conversation if you want, right? Because it's not close the conversation. Podemos seguir la conversación porque no está cerrada con el, con el firewall. ¿Qué es un firewall? Una despedida, ¿verdad? Entonces, pero teacher, si los verbos son este, uh, sin ese teacher, pero en este caso, como estamos hablando de terceras personas, entonces, por ende, los verbos también. Hay unas reglas que dicen que en la mayoría de los verbos regulares, cuando hablamos de terceras personas, se les agrega S. ¿Ok? Que son estos casos, ¿verdad? Son verbos regulares, pero siempre lo vamos a hacer solamente con he, she, and It. It. ¿Ok? Si no es con he, she, it, el verbo no lleva es. Sigue igual, tal y como está. ¿Ok? ¿Es clear? Sí. Okay. ok. Perfect. Excellent. So, let's continue, guys. Ah, oh, by the way, what time is it, guys? Uh, it's almost time. Okay. I would like to make the homework that belongs for today. Would you like to make it like right now? ¿Les gustaría hacer la tarea del día de ahora, chicos, juntos? Yes. Okay, perfect. So, um, let's see. Okay, so let's continue, guys. Okay, instruction. Unscramble the following affirmative and negative statement. Make sure to bend your sentence with a capital letter and type a period at the end. Recuerden escribir la capital letter at the end, al principio, ¿verdad? Al principio, perdón, at the beginning. And uh, also write a period at the end of the sentences. What is the capital letter here? I. I, okay. So that means you are going to write I. Night at sleep. Sleep. At night. At night. At night. Okay. At night. Nice. Sleep at night. So you're going to write a period, right? In this case, yes. you're going to write it like this. Okay. Words factory he enough. What is the be the better uh order, right? He. 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 No, it's he in a war factory. Works. In, factory. in a factory. Okay. He works in a factory. Okay, in a in factory. Work. He works in a factory. factory. Okay, let's see number three. You. You. Uh-huh. You go to the cinema. You go to the cinema, right? It's up here, there, right? So it is not a, a problem, right? Okay, let's continue with the next one. She doesn't uh, speak, 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 speak Portuguese. Uh -huh. She doesn't speak Portuguese. Portuguese. Okay, she doesn't. 
Vaya, eh, aquí hay un problemita, chicos. Este apóstrofe no lo agarra en la, la plataforma, tiene que ser hacia arriba. Ok, recuerden siempre eso, porque si no les va a dar problema. Aquí no me lo agarra a mí porque yo lo tengo así inclinado. Entonces no es, eh, no es como les diría, eh, no lo toma en cuenta, sino que lo toma así. Este yo lo hice copiado de otro documento y lo pegué. Entonces ustedes pueden hacer lo mismo para que la plataforma se los, se los acepte. Si no, no se los va a aceptar. Ok. Ok. Okay, ver, lo he dicho antes. Yes, sí, dale, sí aparecía como errónea la oración. Ajá, pero sí. yo les dije la vez pasada, al, al principio, mire, si esto puede pasar por tal, tal cosa en la primera clase, remember that, ¿ok? Es que no vinieron, no vinieron. <risa> no vinieron. Vaya, ahí está. If you want, you can take a screenshot and you can share in the WhatsApp group in order to have it for the ones that didn't assist today. Oh, okay. Did you take the picture? Yes. Yes, no? Yes. Okay, perfect. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Bye. Ahora viene el área de preguntas. Do you have questions about the, the structure that we were uh, studying, about the grammar, about the examples? It's clear. It's clear? Everything is clear? Are you sure? Clear, like the river, then as water. <laughs> like the river. I'm not coming. This is on. She's also like the river. Uh huh. Somebody has a questions about that so far. Hmm. Guys, I don't have a question. You, you are very clear. Thank you. Okay, perfect. So, so if you have, if you don't have any question, guys, so. Mm. A mí solo lo, lo único que me costó entender un poquito es la. Uh, Cuando está el simple presente, uh -huh. negative for structure. Ahí sí me cuesta un poquito entender la, la estructura de con, la oración. Con el do, el do not o el doesn't not, right? Sí, Ajá, sí. es que eso sí. Pero lo copió la estructura. Sí, sí, lo copió la estructura. El subjetivo más el do o do es el uh -huh. not, el verbo, el complemento, el does not y el don't. Ajá, sí, exacto. Ok. Pero Solo sí, hay me, que... Me... Ajá, sí, sí, sí solo hay que, hay que practicar un poquito. Ajá, porque es más que todo ya uno se lo aprende, ¿verdad? Entonces hay que estudiar, practicar un poquito con las oraciones, seguir solamente la estructura, ¿verdad? Que es lo que vas a ir poniendo y así vas a ir dominándolo. Y recordar que siempre con terceras personas utilizamos das o dasen. Y cuando utilizamos dasen o... El verbo no, no cambia, no se le agrega S en nada, queda igual, ¿verdad? porque el dasen absorbe la S del verbo, que en este caso sería en tercera persona. Pero eso más después lo vamos a hablar. Mañana se los, veo, se los voy a eh, detallar un poquito más y les voy a traer una práctica para que podamos practicar en eso. ¿Okay? Y la parte, y la parte donde dijo la tercera, las terceras personas eh, en verbos regulares, solo ahí es donde debemos de utilizar hichi y it. Ajá, en tercera persona, con los verbos regulares, solamente se les agrega S, ¿verdad? Ah, Solo vez. cuando hablamos de he, she, and it. Hay más eh, excepciones en las que tú vas a agregar S eh, y vas a cambiar la Y por la Y latina, más la S, pero eso lo voy a explicar mañana. Voy a tratar de explicar esa parte mañana porque son como tres reglas que tenemos de, de aprendernos. Y, y la que se agrega el ING también mañana. Vale, ING... 
es el continuo, pero eso sí todavía no lo vamos a ver, eso es más mm. adelante. Ah, es que creí, creí, creí que tenía la misma relación con el DONS eh, y el, el IND, IND, ¿verdad? No, ING. El, IN, el ING es participio, eh, con él puedes hablar de futuro y puedes hablar de la acción que está pasando en este momento, pero está en proceso. Mm, de acuerdo. Ok. Perfect. Ok, so, any questions so far? No. Okay, thank you so much, guys, for being here. And I see you tomorrow at the same time and same channel, okay? Bye-bye and have a nice day. Good night, everybody. Ciao, ciao. Bye-bye. Good night, girls and boys. Ta-ta. That's sexy, Rorro. That's sexy. Hoy la, hoy la teacher que por qué te dicen rorro es explicarle rorro ay no sé mañana tomorrow please explain it to me es el bigote el bigote ah ah ya yeah, I know I got it I got it okay el ahí el ahí he's no, a liar no. right okay bye bye take care see you too